This coming Friday, being the 25th of January 2019, we have a VIP demo of Anthem. Then on Friday the 1st of February, an open demo, meaning all you need is the Origin client and download the game and you are in. Is Anthem going to be any good? Is it worth the money? Let me give you my thoughts. Ladies and gents, welcome back. I am Montoya. Having played a few hours in the alpha, I have a pretty clear picture of what Anthem is about. To answer the most common question, is this game any good? There is no correct, all-encompassing answer. It all depends on your definition of what good is. For me, I enjoyed playing Warframe. I enjoyed Destiny. I played a bit of Division, never stuck around much for that one. But if you enjoyed Warframe, and if you enjoyed Destiny, and if you enjoy the co-op of Division, odds are high you will enjoy Anthem. Each of the games I mentioned there have certain features or aspects I like and did not like. Hate on me if you will, but the aesthetics of Warframe are simply not my taste. It is very original and very well done. But the Iron Man type look of the Javelins is a lot more my style. So point goes to Anthem there. Destiny, I feel, had the most comfortable, if that's the right word, game mechanics. There was no learning curve. I grabbed my Warlock and off I went. Everything felt exactly as it should. It was easy to simply jump into the game and go. No hours needed to learn how to play. The problem... I have with Destiny are twofold. One is that all the classes are pretty much the same except for the supers. It's not a bad thing, but after a while you do wish for some variety, at least I did. The second issue I had with Destiny, which was my fault, was that I never really played Destiny 1. In fact, I, I skipped over it completely. So I always felt that I missed a lot of what the story and character progression was about. Not my fault is when the next DLC drops and they want another $40 from you or else I cannot progress with my friends. That part sucks. And that is one reason I don't play anymore. Anthem addresses these very issues. Every javelin is unique in its abilities. As for future DLCs in Anthem, no more splitting up your base between those willing to pay and those who cannot afford it or just don't feel like spending more money on the same game. Anthem DLCs will be free. With Anthem, I get to play the Destiny-like game I like from the very start, with the progression system I enjoy, and free expansions like Warframe. I am in a very happy place. With that said, it's not all roses. There are always issues, and there might be issues in Anthem. For example, what happens when I have my Ranger Javelin min-maxed? What happens when I have my Storm raining down death and one-shotting the biggest enemies? Will this game keep us engaged with the game-as-a-service model? Will I keep grinding for the rare cosmetic item, or as Warframe calls it, Fashion Frame Endgame? While Anthem plays smooth and the Frostbite engine looks great, it's a lot faster paced than Destiny and a lot more difficult to get up close and lay down those headshots. I'll be honest, I prefer Destiny's slower gameplay mechanics, but maybe that's because I haven't had much time in there, in Anthem that is. And I hate, hate bullet sponge enemies. I prefer one-shotting and plowing my way through mods like in Warframe. I haven't leveled up far enough in Anthem to experience that yet, but I'm hoping we do get there, so I withhold judgment on that account until we get to that point. I know when I pay $60 for, say, Far Cry, I know I'm going to get 50 or 60 hours of gameplay, and I'm happy with that. Now, Anthem, I'm not interested in 60 hours. I expect it to be something I can continually come back to and play an hour here, four hours there, and keep on coming back. Is this going to be the case? I cannot tell you until we get there. If the progression system is engaging enough, and if the game tickles you, well, tickles your power fantasy in just the right spot, and if Bioware is true to form and gives us a solid storyline with deep and engaging characters, then yes, it is totally worth it. Bottom line is, for 60 bucks, is it worth it? To me, yes. Is it worth it to you? Like I said in the beginning, if you're a fan of Destiny and Warframe and Division, then I think you will definitely like this. If you want a group to play with, definitely check out our Gilded link right there. It is gilded.gg slash test. You can always find 
uh, other people play, you can jump in and join us anytime. Also, we are on Discord all the time, uh, discord.gg slash test. You will find us all in there. To all my Patreon backers, thank you for your continued support. I really do appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this content, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. If you want to hear more about Anthem, definitely hit that button. And I will see you in the next one.